Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG with Classic Gamer Dave. And in the last episode we got a bunch of hints as to what this password is. So yeah, let's uh... I'll go ahead and just type it in. P E A R L S. Now see, okay, so it spells pearls, obviously. Now see that that hint that said two consonants are are side by side. Well, there's three that are side by side, so it's a little misleading. It's still true, but it, it is misleading. I will say that. Okay. So when you're let's, let's see what this says. Once you've come up with the key letters, speak in here. Okay. Yep. Pearls. So, whoa! What the? Oh my god! Uh, if you can get past me first. Okay, who's me? Um. Oh god. Alright, so I'm gonna do a little bit of explaining before we start here. Um, so there are two different types of tentacles here. It doesn't say that there are, but there are. There are, um, two left tentacles, and one, and there's one right tentacle. Um, yeah, I don't know how to exp else explain it other than that. And they're both, uh, weak to fire, and they defend, they have a def defense against all the statuses, basically. But the, uh, left tentacles have 200 HP, and the right tentacles have 260. Now, once you get past these tentacles, um, there are, oh god, there are, uh, there's another set of tentacles, and in that, that's basically, I'd call that phase two, and in that there are two, there's one left tentacle and two right tentacles, so it gets just a smidge harder, it's not that much harder at all, just 68, 60 extra. Let me try that again. 60 extra HP among among them. So yeah, not, it's not a big deal at all. All right, it's a good idea to do group heals a lot in this in this uh, set of battles because the tentacles like to um, throw people up in the air and it puts fear status on them. So yeah, so this this one's a left tentacle over here, and there's only one. Yeah, it, it's like the opposite way that they're, that they're facing. The, so that's the easy tentacle, and then the other two on the left are the right tentacles, and they're the harder ones. Oh man, Peach died. Uh, I better do a pick me up. Can't have her out the whole battle. Alright, so, yeah, just to have, have him attack one tentacle at a time is what I do. And then <clears throat> you can have Mario, uh, might as well do it. Um, have Mario do fireballs and stuff. Uh, super flame. I'll just have him attack one of these. Is that one on the right's almost dead? Yeah, it's a, a fairly straightforward battle other than that. And then there's one phase after that, after this one, so... Um, I'm gonna do another group up. We've got plenty of FP. Um, I'm not getting the timing right on that. Uh, so have Mario attack this. That. Um, yeah, I always remembered having a really, really hard time figuring out that password. I probably spent like two or three days when I was younger, and I, I never actually figured it out. My dad did. I put all the letter combinations on this big piece of paper, and just, I sat there and I would put different words together. I fell asleep one night trying to figure it out, and my dad took it and put down pearls. I was pretty young, though. I'm not sure exactly how old I was. I feel like maybe I was six or something. This, wasn't this, this game released in 96? If I was, if it was, I was about six at the time then. So. Okay, so now there's one left tentacle, one right tentacle, and then 
the head portion, which is King Calamari. Yeah, pretty creative name there. And he's got the same weaknesses, weakness and defense as the tentacles do. It's all the same, same body, so... Yeah, no, no secrets there. But, uh, the head section, I call it, but it's called King Calamari, um, actually has, uh, 800 HP. And Venom Drool! No! Now we're poisoned. Yeah. But it's no big deal, this easy fight. I kind of wish there was more di dialogue. He talks, like, to you in the room before, but he doesn't say jack to you when you get here, and I just... I thought it would have been cool if he would have, like, you know, talked to you while you were fighting the tentacles or something. I always thought that would have been a little interesting. Yeah, that fire attack, Mario did nearly a quarter of King Calamari's damage in one go, so... <laughs> big of a fight. And this is not the end of the ship, so this isn't even the final battle. And yeah, keep going with the fire flame, or the super flame. Fire flame? Yeah. Yeah. Another venom drool. We better group heal after this. Oh, it's gonna be Bowser. Still, we should group heal. If nothing but for Bowser. It doesn't cost that much more than therapy. Therapy is the single heal a single target, group hug heals everyone. There we go, I got the... I've been really lazy with the, uh, um, timed hits thing. So, I'm not, yeah, I'm not doing nearly max anything usually. I just kind of get a little lazy about it and start to forget about it. Oh, there we go. So there was King Calamari. Yeah. Not a big deal at all. 100 coins. Not that we need it. And Mario's gonna level up his pa attack power. And <laughs> Mallow reaches another level. God. This level's like crazy. Alright. So now we're in the next section. Um, okay. Let me turn my sheep back over to the enemy side. I was on the boss's side. Okay, for what we know, let's. I, I, I didn't even say words just then. So we can't go anywhere there, so we gotta go up here. And whoa, we got alley rats. Basically, um, yeah, just avoid the the bullet bills. You can't. They can't attack you, but they knock you off, and it's just an annoyance. <laughs> and to get up here, you just do that. Yeah, we don't need coins at all, but, uh, we don't need coins, so. I'm pretty sure I have max, maxed out my coins, so. Uh, let me check real quick. Yeah, 99 coins. 999 coins. 99. So the only hidden treasure chest in the ship is in this room, and you see I have a doppelganger here. So the first thing you want to do is some, sometimes he jumps with you. I think it's when you're looking away and not moving. Or maybe just when you're not moving. Otherwise, he just stays still. Um, oh, there we go. So, if you jump around enough, you'll find this. And then you can see the hidden treasure chest right there. So there it is. Otherwise, you'd be like, jumping up on top of each other. and be like, okay, we crap is it, you know, so. Cool. Alright. Next section. And more dry bones here. I don't think there's anything, well. Oh, there is something back here. Ah, frog coin. Cool. Yeah, I don't really remember that for some reason. Eh, peach level. Yeah, I never really think to go back there. Oh, uh, Peach just learned, uh, magic attack called comeback which is basically going to replace pick me ups for the rest of the game for me not not necessarily replace either because sometimes she'll need she'll need assistance okay so now um now we've got a little bit of fight here uh, you may want to save before this battle right there um let me turn over my paper and you can probably guess that this is a 
where the heck did I put it? Hang on. Wait. Wait. Where did I put it? Uh, oh, okay, there it is. Alright. So, this is a fight, you can obviously tell. And these are always decently tough fights. Um, so this is Hydon, and he has 600 HP. He does pretty brutal attacks like that. Um, might as well do therapy here. There we go. And uh, he's weak to fire thunder. Or wait, no, he's he's weak to jump. And he, I'm, I'm just gonna do super jump here. So hang on. And uh, yeah, so he spawns these goombets, and they are weak to fire, thunder, and jump. Now, if you do fire, or if you, I mean, if you do thunder. You can take them all out in one go. Because, yeah, they're just quick to it. That'll work. Um, otherwise, you gotta sit here and fight them. And so that's another reason to have Mallow in your party. So I would probably have, had I known or thought about it, I would have definitely gone back and used Mallow for this whole situation, for the whole ship section. Instead of probably Bowser. I like having Peach in my party. No, you know what? I would have put her put him in place of Peach, I think. Because he can heal. And so that that would have been fine. Oh does it is nice getting Peach leveled here, but I'm gonna have her pretty much for the rest of the game, so yeah. It's not really good. This is pretty much my party for the rest of the game. Just so you know. And here we go, bam. So yeah, uh, the Goombats each have 100 HP, and Hydon has 600, if I didn't say that already. Yeah, it's not a terribly hard fight, and we get the safety badge, which is a great uh, equip piece. Let's put the Mario, show you what it does. Um, and prevents mutant poison attacks, which is, and it's it erases your stuff. I can't, I can't form cohesive thoughts. That's, that's much it. Uh, I know what I'm trying to say, I just can't. I'm unable. This is one of the few areas of the game where I don't try to fight every enemy on the screen. Um, I usually am completely thorough with that. Uh, yeah, so we have Mr. Kipper here again, but we also have a new enemy here, uh, Krusty. And for some reason, he's not on my list. Crap. Oh, alright, well, anyway. I'm sure he's not weak to thunder. <laughs> Seeing as he's a water enemy. I know, I know Mr. Kipper is strong against fire, so... I mean, he's weak to fire. Oh, Mr. Kipper's weak thunder as well. So. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure what Krusty's stats are. I'm sure I'll post like an annotation or something eventually. So, yeah. And if I forget, I'm sure nobody would really care at all. I mean, honestly, if I was if I was watching this video, I would be interested in the stats. But if there was something not said, I wouldn't look it up. <laughs> Unless it was like a boss or something and I was particularly interested. Yeah, I don't know. I would prefer looking them up myself if I was if I really cared at all. It, this is one of those games where it doesn't really matter. I just do it so there's something different. Sometimes there's interesting little things. Oh, what was I saying? Uh, sometimes there's interesting little things that you can find out about enemies like that. Um sea creatures are weak to fire attacks. So. Okay, we've got uh, one new enemy here that we uh, you could possibly see before you get into the ship, but if you fight, if you actually went through and fought all the uh, starfish guys, but uh, the uh, Zeo stars that is, and that's the uh, I don't 
not sure how to say it. Luco, I guess, is how I would say it. I'm not sure. But uh, he's quite tough um, for a normal enemy. He's 220 HP, and he's strong against Thunder. But it kind of makes sense for him because he's kind of like a uh, what do you call him? A uh, jellyfish, and they you know, they yeah he can use like electrical attacks, so that makes sense. But he's also weak to fire, and he's underwater, so that doesn't make sense. <laughs> I mean, I guess if you took him out of water and set him on fire, that would... But, I mean, I don't know. There's a whole debate there that I'm not going to get into. And it's weird because it is Square, that developer's game, and I feel like that's something that they're usually... Well, no, I shouldn't say that. A lot of Final Fantasy games where it's just like, why is this enemy weak to this, or that enemy weak to that? I don't know. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see the time. Um, yeah, I'm going to get to a good spot to stop at. I'm going to stop there. Okay, poison gas. It's another hits all enemy, uh, attack. Kind of like terrorize, but with poison instead of fear status. And it's a bit stronger. Okay, so we've got a blooper there, and I'm going to jump up to the top here. Up on the dry land. Come on. There we go, and I'm going to see you guys next time. Later.